Good morning everybody. I am Mercy Victoria, Assistant Professor of English, Government First Grade College, Kanatpura. Welcome to BCom First Semester General English Class, Session 11. Today we are going to see a lesson called Daughter, written by Lata Jaktiani. This is a lesson prescribed for First semester BCom. The learning objective of this particular lesson is to create an awareness of gender equality and inequality in various spheres of life. It is also to create an awareness with the recent developments in law. At the end of this session, the students will be able to understand the meaning of gender inequality, patriarchy and discrimination in gender. They will be also able to understand the nuances of inequality in the upper strata of the society. Before we move into the lesson, let's have an introduction. Do you have siblings, brothers, younger brothers, elder brothers? How does your parents treat you and your brother? Is there a difference in their treatment? Do you have any restrictions at home as a girl child? Like you have, you are not allowed to go out after 6 o'clock or you should be back home by 6. You cannot go out after it gets dark, you know, etc. Name some problems faced by women in today's society. What according to you is gender inequality? Where can one find gender inequality? Where are, what are the spheres? Which are the spheres we find gender inequality? With this point in mind, let's move on to the lesson. Before we get into the lesson, let's have a quick review on the author. Lata Jaktiani was born and brought up in Mumbai. She is a postgraduate in English literature and aesthetics from Mumbai University. She currently lectures in creative writing for journalism students at KC College, Mumbai. She also writes spiritual columns in the Times of India and DNA Mumbai editions. She is proficient in several languages and some of her books include Temple Bells and Other Stories, Towards Light, Bhagavad Gita in 365 days and Sindhi Reflections. Her interests are to dream, read, swim and travel both India and abroad. Daughter by Lata Jaktiani This particular lesson is about a 70-year-old technocrat's death. This 78-year-old technocrat called Sham Suresh Shamdas Chabaria dies after a short illness. After his death, they were called to Saurabh Sahib's office, his family lawyer, to read his will. His office is situated near the Oval Grounds. Sham Das Chabaria has four sons and a daughter called Deepa. All five of them gather in Saurabh Sahib's office anxiously to listen to the will. The only daughter of Sham Das, Deepa, is a 27-year-old lake girl. According to the will, Suresh Sham Das Chabaria leaves all his wealth to be shared equally to his sons, whereas his only daughter is left with 7 lakh rupees in the form of Reserve Bank of India bonds and rest of the property 
is being divided equally among four sons. The very fact that she's the only daughter has left her with seven lakh rupees. Whereas being the men or boys of the family, they get to enjoy the rest of the property. They've been divided equally among four sons. When Deepa heard this, she was shocked, surprised, whereas the boys or the sons of Suresh Shamdas Chabaria did not react at all. It was as though they had anticipated this. They were very clear that his father would have written the will in such a way. It was such a shock for the daughter Deepa. After the will was read, all four brothers left the lawyer's office without any reaction. They did not have any feelings for their only sister, Deepa. They were satisfied and they were also quite contented that the property had been divided among themselves. It so happened, Shorab Sahib's office is next to a cricket stadium, Oval Cricket Stadium. There happened to be a cricket match at the Oval Stadium. Deepa was in fact quite disappointed and depressed after hearing the will. When all the brothers left the lawyer's office, Deepa was reluctant to join them. One, because she was disappointed. Two, she was shocked. Three, she was, she was sad. She just couldn't do anything. She just stood there staring through the window at the cricket match that was happening at the Oval Stadium. Thus, daughter starts with a sad note of the will being read at Shorab Sahib's office. The reaction of the brothers, reaction of Deepa, who was left with just 7 lakh rupees, that too in the form of Reserve Bank of India bonds, whereas her brothers were left with huge sum of money. This situation has happened only because she was a girl child. Let's see what happens in the next class.